so you're approaching at the same time, is that correct? Uh, yeah, just about, yes. Where did that black SUV go? Uh, probably about kind of right in front of the house, I would say. When you stop um, in front of the driveway, about how far away from you is the black SUV that you saw? Probably a car or a car length in front of me, a car length and a half in front of me. What, if anything, was in between the truck, Ricky's truck, and the, the black SUV in front? Uh, there's nothing, sir. And when you came out to the truck at the end of the driveway, what, if any, other vehicles did you see in the area of, of the house on Um. Well, before when I went outside, I did notice another vehicle before my brother pulled up. No, he was like fully outside already, and then I went out, and it was just Ricky's truck. And so at some point later, there was another vehicle that came up? Um, prior. prior. Okay. Correct. About how long was it that you were at the hillside? I would say I was probably there hour-ish, give or take. And do you know about what time you left? Uh, probably around midnight. And when you left from there, where was it? I went to pick up my sister, Julie, because she shot me a text asking for a ride. And so you were at the hillside when you received the text from your sister, Julie, correct? Correct, sir. About how long was it after you received the text from your sister to the time that you sort of jump in the truck and start to go over to there? Probably 40 minutes or so. We kind of took our time. She said she didn't like, she wasn't saying come now. She just said, you know, when you get a second, you come pick me up and bring me home. So when was it that the last person met? The last person. Uh, I wouldn't know the ex I couldn't tell you the time. I don't, I don't remember times. Um, well, the last people to leave were Auntie JJ, Uncle Matt, Sarah, and Julie. So about what time was it that you, uh, that you left the home on Fairview on that particular evening? Between 1.30 and 2 a.m. And you left uh, with your friend, Ms. Nagel, as well as uh, Mr. and Mrs. BK, correct? Correct. Um, I don't know exactly what time that would be. I, I can't even guess. I don't know. I don't, I don't remember times. Yeah, so at some point, my friend Julie um, stood up and said, oh, my brother's outside. Um, her brother was there to pick her up. She went outside to talk to her brother. Um, and so I looked out the window at that point. And she was outside talking to her brother. So his truck was there. And I saw another um, car there as well. No, he was like fully outside already. And then I went out. And it was just Ricky's truck. And so at some point later, there was another vehicle that came up? Um, prior. prior. Okay. Correct. Yeah, so I saw a truck, um, which was Julie Nagel's brother's truck, I believe. Um, and that was a little ways, almost like in front of the driveway um, of the house. And then a little ways in front of it, um, there was another car that I, didn't, I hadn't recognized before. It was a dark SUV-ish. And that's all I knew about it and could see about it. Now... Similar to yourself, uh, with anyone else from sort of a group of, of people, either in the kitchen or in the house, um, could you observe near a window or a door that was looking on that? Um, I believe my uncle Matt McCabe um, noticed the car outside as well. Um, well. The last people to leave were Auntie JJ, Uncle Matt, Sarah, and Julie. Your sister, Caitlin, is that oh, oh, yes, I'm sorry. She, I was just thinking of her as my sister, like the sibling. Um, so she didn't live in the house, so she was the last person to leave. And prior to her leaving is when your auntie JJ, Uncle Matt. And yes. Yeah. What door and how did she? I would say the side door next to the garage. I went off through the front door. She crossed through the lawn a little bit, but obviously walked down the driveway because we were at the end of it. It's true that you said that the second time you looked out, you saw that there was a black SUV that had pulled forward. Okay. Yes. But the truck was no longer there. Sure, it seems like I said that then, yes. She went outside to talk to her brother. Um, and so I looked out the window at that point. And she was outside talking to her brother. So his truck was there. And I saw another um, car there as well. Who was in the house the second time that you looked out the window? Um, it would have been my mom, my dad, um, Brian Higgins. How long did you stay at the Albert, Albert residence in total? But from the time you got there to the time you left? Maybe like a half hour, less than an hour. And what time did you leave? Uh, say 1230, you said? I, th I think I said between 1230 and one, okay. one. And it was just Ricky's truck. I walked down the steps through the little path um, and then down the driveway. And they were parked right in front of the driveway. So they were parked right at the end of the driveway? Yes. 
they were parked right in front of the driveway. So they were parked right at the end of the driveway? Yes. 